Our next performance comes from that opera, ladies and gentlemen, from Roberto Devereaux. Please welcome to the stage COC ensemble member Charlotte Burridge with Al Aflito e Dolce Il Pianto. Charlotte Burridge, ladies and gentlemen. between Sarah, the, the aria that you just sung, and Elizabeth I, who wins the man? Who, who does? Uh, this is one of these classic love triangle opera stories, and unfortunately, everyone dies in the end. I think the page boy is the only one who survives. <laughs> that was fantastic, though, a beautiful performance. Now, you grew up in small town Ontario. Uh, you were kind of a jock in school, is that correct? I did play a lot of sports in school, volleyball, I love rowing, um, yeah. <laughs> so how did your life change the first time you heard uh, the great Canadian contralto Maureen Forrester? Uh, Maureen Forrester, that was the first CD I ever bought of opera. It was a CD of uh, Handel Arias. And I read her biography and she was from a small town and started as choirs and I just related it. It seems like a possibility after reading her biography. 
were you already singing at this point? I was, yeah, I grew up singing in choirs and taking piano and voice when I was younger. So I have to, you know, a singer, especially a professional singer, spends a lot of time working on their craft. You, you work with the vocal trainers and you do a lot of uh, practicing and rehearsing on your own. So what is it like, what, what does it mean when you're in front of an audience like the one here today? Um, this is one of the rewards of hard work. I think uh, most opera singers love performing and just being able to express beautiful music and be a medium for uh, for an audience and the composer and what was expected. You're, you're in the uh, ensemble program, which is one of the greatest uh, artistic programs for young people in, in, in the world. And you're an advocate for opera. As a young person, you're an advocate for opera. Because some people think it's it's for old people. But but what is your elevator pitch? If you were trying to tell people to go and see the, the three operas this season at COC, how would you sell that to the people who are here today? Um, I would say that opera is sexy and everyone should go. <laughs> That's pretty hard to pass that up, isn't it, ladies and gentlemen? Uh, will you sing again for a song? I guess so. Would you like that audience? She seems to be... Okay, yes, yes. So that's a big vote for yes. Charlotte Burroughs, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Joining Charlotte...